Go Bring them this way. We can't get in the other way. You gotta go this way. Members of the 740th Transportation Company, based out of Millbank, and its detachment, based out of Aberdeen, quickly got to work upon their arrival in Dakota Dunes to support the Missouri River flood protection efforts. The 740th went from annual training into state active duty on June 23rd. After only one day on location in Dakota Dunes, members of the QRF, or Quick Reactionary Force, were called to action to shore up a section of the levee. Our mission is the uh, QRF, or the Quick Reactionary Force. We're stationed up in the circle right now, and um, this is what we respond to. If they need sandbag missions, uh, you know, spring holes, those kind of things, and we shore them up until the contractors can get in with the equipment. Uh, currently what we're doing is reinforcing this le um, the backside of the levee that kind of had a little cave in to uh, help shore up the levee and then tomorrow they're going to bring in the excavators and the packers to break and bring it back up. They'll actually bring it right to his, if you look down his window level, they're going to bring the dirt right up to his window. Kind of give it a slope so it's not, as you can look right here, you'll see how it's caving in. The 740th took over the Quick Reactionary Force mission from the 153rd Engineer Battalion. Forward Support Company, who had been working in Dakota Dunes since the South Dakota National Guard was called to state active duty in May. Some members of the 153rd volunteered to stay behind to help train the 740th and operate some of the heavy equipment alongside members of the 740th. The levy support mission is ongoing and will likely last throughout the summer. Reporting in Dakota Dunes, I'm Air Force Senior Master Sergeant Don McClear.